Hey, it's Drew Bennett from Ben Spark Family Adventures, and I'm back with another holiday gift guide idea for you parents out there. Now, this time I am talking about Build a Bot from Relevant Play. They sent me this for free so that I could do a review of this and assemble this and show you this for the holiday gift guide. Now, there will be a link below. It's an affiliate link of mine to Amazon.com. So if you wanted to pick this up for your kids, then use my link below. Anyway, I'm going to open this up and you're going to take a look at what this Build-A-Bot looks like on all the little pieces of it. So I have my Build-A-Bot box. I'm going to open that up and then inside are all the pieces to put together that unicorn. Okay, and in here we got these instructions, lots of instructions on how to do that. There's also a sticker sheet so that you can personalize that unicorn of yours. So there you go, you got that. And let's see. Now this unicorn is gonna do some interesting things. Um, it's gonna hop, make sounds, it's going to uh, do a whole bunch of different things. So let's start with number one. This is like inside out almost. So we're gonna start with step number one and we're going to find the feet. So we have all our pieces here and we're going to start following the instructions and we're going to start building the feet. So we gotta grab this out here and we have the different feet. Now they only go in one certain way. So you have to, first of all, take a look and see if you've got the right foot. So the foot will only, there you go. It'll only go in one specific way and make it look like this, okay? And then you take the other part of it and you gotta match that up too. So we're gonna take these two pieces and we're gonna snap them together. So now we have the foot clipped together. You can see that, how that looks. So what we've done now is we've done steps one and two. And now I'm gonna take step three, and this is the motorized part. This right here is the part that's, that's motorized. This is the part you're gonna like be able to turn on and use, but you have to put some batteries in. And uh, I think you need a couple double A's. So we're gonna take this part here. So this talks about the motors. Next is your pet's motors. Motors can make a lot of things move, like cars, planes, elevators, and even some of your toys. So this gives the kids different uh, instructions then and also kind of explains more like hey this is what this would do and this is what this would do and this is why you would do this uh, we also have these special pieces here and they go on the motor clip these like that there then take that one pop that one on as well and from here we're going to put another part on top so we've got these pieces oh and it's also saying uh attach the feet which i kind of missed on the other side so we're attaching the legs number nine and number nine is going here nope we're turning around okay number nine is going here which is attaching to that little peg and this moving peg. So that one goes there. Part number 10 is going to go here and there. So it's, it's setting up the body. So you got your leg here, you got your body here, and leg pin, lever, Eight, right there okay that's good and now number six we're gonna take that that leg that we made I believe it's gonna be this one no it's not it's gonna be this one because the it's gonna put one peg here in the hole and the other one is going on this so that as you move so you get your leg here and then we're gonna put the tail on there we go. So tails there because the tail is probably going to move as well. Uh, here it says levers are used to move things. Examples of levers include seesaws and scissors. 
And then we go to the other side, right over here. You get that. We've got this piece that fell off. That piece right there. And we are now putting in the leg. This leg is going to go like that, right here. We've got the body. We've got the tail. We're missing one of the legs. That is what we're going to put on next. I'm going to put the other leg here. And there we go. So we've got the feet on all the way around our unicorn. And now we're going to assemble the head. So we're going to take the head pieces out. So we've got the two head pieces. Then we've got the nose. If we're looking at the face, there we go. We got the nose on here. We're going to put the unicorn horn on. So that's back in there. The unicorn horn goes here. So it's going to... We got the unicorn horn, we got the nose, and then we're going to assemble part of it to the head part here. So we want, let's see, so we want to go and attach it so it's got part of it right here, and then it just looks like we're going to take the other side and we're going to attach it there. So now we have our little unicorn baby there. And we're going to put on the unicorn's ears. These are kind of softer, a little different. Uh, I'm going to pop the ears on. So now we've got the ears on the unicorn. They seem correct. I think. If I think so. There we go. And uh, let's see. Then we need two AA batteries. So I'm going to go get those. I'm going to put AA batteries in the bottom. It has a little screwdriver a screw there. So we have to get a screwdriver pop those in there, but two AA batteries, I'll go get those and put them in. I've got the cover off and I'm going to pop in the batteries. Here are two AA batteries. And as soon as you put it in, we're getting some noises from our unicorn. Now we can customize our unicorn with a set of stickers. So I'm thinking this unicorn, uh, gonna have these eyes. I think, I think the, let's turn her off for a second. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, so we're gonna put some, these special eyes on her. Okay, so look, now we've got a unicorn with some fun eyes. Once you've built your bot, then you get a build certificate. It was fun building it. So we got our baby unicorn all built and we're gonna turn her on. And she's going to start making some noises. Now she responds to sound. So if you're going to say clap in front of her, she has a microphone right up front here, uh, right there. So she's going to respond to the things you say. And she'll even do some moving and just kind of hop towards you. So that's one of the things that she'll do. If you lift the tail, you're going to get some different sounds. Okay, so she's going to respond to sound, and that's really all she's going to do. She's going to respond to sound. She might do some little walking and hopping, but when kids, you know, when they want to make some noise and play with her, then she'll respond to the sound and maybe even start walking towards them. Anyway, it's Drew Bennett from Ben Spark Family Adventures. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter as BenSpark, Facebook.com slash Ben Spark Family Adventures, and you can find me here making videos all the time. I'd like to thank Relevant Play for sending me the build -a bot this little cute little unicorn thing. Uh, that's part of my holiday gift guide. There's going to be a link down below and if you want to pick up one of these. It's great to show kids stuff about levers and machines and engines and how sound vibration works. It's really an interesting thing to get them like started to taking a look at that. Anyway, thanks for watching.